Top of the time zone, sports fans. It is Freddie J here for Freddie J Sports. And we're back. We're taking a break from the fight to the top mode, but it's 2023. To give you some more of us racing Dale Jarrett's Ford UPS truck. Today's race, we are going to... If I could find it. Las Vegas. Uh, we recently had a race at Las Vegas currently for the NASCAR Cup Series. And my idea was to, hey, let's go ahead and race it here. And why not? I mean, Las Vegas is one of the tracks I uh, struggle dearly off. Welcome welcomes you to the Diamond in the Desert, the Las Vegas Motor Speedway. Today's NASCAR Nextel Cup event, the UAW Daimler Chrysler 400, is sure to be one of the most hotly contested races of the season. This track is known for its wide open racing, but in the desert, things often run hot, including the drivers. Fuel mileage and pit crew performance will have a huge impact on today's race. This is Las Vegas, where a little gambling could pay off big time. It's time to roll the dice. I'm so not prepared for that. Is that us? No, it doesn't sound like us. But yeah, uh, decided to run this since the cup race ran it. And let's just say, uh, I don't know. I haven't been good at Las Vegas in the past. So this will be great practice run for when I do, uh, I think the truck series goes to Las Vegas in the fight to the top mode. But yeah, this is going to be a big deal. The last videos I did for the racing the truck series, uh, I was strong until the very last second. And I would like to be able to continue to be strong here. As uh, Las Vegas reminds me a lot like Michigan, to be honest. I'm gonna break here. I don't normally use the brakes, so I usually ease off the gas, but that worked out pretty fine. I'm slowly dropping spots back, currently in fifth place. Let's see how this turn goes. Let it roll in the corners. Punch down hard. There we go. Looking good. Looking good. We might get the pole. We might get the pole in this lap. We might get the pole this lap. Can we get it? Oh my goodness. We were fourth. Drifting up the racetrack, but this time it's not moving a, a muscle. The needle has stayed on the first. I have a good truck here. Oh my goodness, we might get the pole. Oh my goodness, that is a pole right there. Yes, we love to see it. Also, I need to figure out who had this theme because I was trying to look for this on YouTube, but I couldn't find out what television network had this theme for the race because I thought it was NBC and TNT but that wasn't the case so we're starting on the pole hopefully we stay up there and uh, let's get to it Carlo is on my side Tony Stewart behind me Brian Vickers 32 laps and we're underway Tony Stewart now. Ooh, Carlo was just hit the wall right there. Tony Stewart currently on my tail. Tenth to the second back. Can I lead the first lap? That's the question. Right now, the car is good. Sliding up the wall, but it looks like I'm going to be okay. Tony Stewart now hitting the wall. That's five points for me if this was uh, this season. What we're going to eventually do, I'm going way too high. Whoa. 
three wide already. We'll hit the wall there, and that's going to be good save. What a great save right there. All right, so I dropped six spots from me clipping the wall and go like one I went too high and then I hit the wall still hitting the best lap so far so it's not too bad so that shows us promise here got Ryan Newman right in front of us see if you can share drive them to, to get back up there gonna go tuck down low this is dangerous right here you don't want to spin out because of that Alto. Who remembers Alto? I don't know who Alto merged with. I think it was Sprint. And then Sprint merged with T-Mobile. Whoa, what is Michael Waltrip doing? Um, I'm right down here, buddy. Buddy was really trying to force me off the track the way he, like he was trying to block. That was not cool. I should probably give him a piece of my mind, but I'm like, nah, it's too soon. It's too soon. It's only five laps in. We still got a long race to go, and I'm going back up high again. Gonna have to punch it back down. And I save it this time. Hanging on to this spot. We're losing a little bit of ground on the leaders, too. Tony Stewart has been leading the last few laps. Followed by, uh, I can't tell who's that blue car. Oh. I think that's Kurt Busch. The hometown favorite. Followed by Elliot Sadler, Ryan Newman, Michael Waltrip, Mia's Dale Jarrett, Mark Martin. I believe that's the three car and Jeff Gordon. Looks like the three car. Past Carl Edwards. I'm mirror watching right now because uh, nothing's really happening here. Oh, here we go. Big time hit. Incidental content, but we're in the top five yet again. About to pass the Michael Waltrip. Michael Waltrip is blocking hard. That's what he gets. Bro was blocking way too hard for me. Had to shake him off. Using that good old Intimidator. I believe it should be amplified since I have the a UPS truck. That would be kind of scary. Alright, so now I got Elias Sadler right here. Back up there with the leaders. A little touch right there. But I'm going to get this spot. Here's Kurt trying to get a, get going to inside. Oh my goodness. I went too high. And then there goes Michael Walter. Ryan Newman back at it again. Passing extremely low to get that pass. Tony Stewart still leading after 10. One second back. Michael Walter trying to go on the inside again. Now I'm back on Kurt Busch. Elliot Salad now the second place. Look at that. Back in third. Now it's Elliot and Tony. Now pitch strategy is about to come in as we're at a lap 11. And I uh, did not pinch it. It was uh, drifting up too high. Is Tony trying to block me right now? Or is he trying to get a share draft? 
I don't need a share draft. I'm here to pass you. Look at that crossover. Crossover for the lead. A little contact right there. Whoa, big hit. Oh my goodness. Waltrip is seriously mad. Oh, big wreck. Good gracious. Good. Oh my goodness. Get out of my way. Man. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and pit. Going to replace right sides with fuel. 25 should be good. There's no way I'm the only one that didn't pit. Let's see how this pit strategy works out. And of course, nobody comes out to jack up the car or anything. Yeah, everyone, yeah, right, every, the whole pit crew's fired. We're starting in the back, so be careful and stay out of trouble. Oh my goodness, nobody pitted. I mean, honestly, it's outside the pit window anyway, but I feel like I could probably. Oh, Elliot Sathers now. Elliot Sather is not blocking. Oops. All right, well, we got to work our way up to the front. Whoa! Was not expecting that. Whoa. Man. So, reminder not to do that angle again. I mean, every angle you do is kind of difficult to actually see, but we've been beating up or said a little bit too much. I think I should be clear. And I finally take the lead yet again. Now with 12 laps to go. Let's see if this is the strategy here. They're going double file at the restart. Doing a silent commentary cast right now is really difficult to do. I'm trying to make sure I keep a quiet voice down. It's currently midnight. Doing this race. 11 to go. Kurt Busch about to get on the inside here. Will he be able to make the pass? Look at the momentum. Oh my goodness. Whoa, big wreck. That was totally an accident, by the way. Was not, like, just spun me out. It won't. Dude really just clipped my left rear quarter panel and just went the other way. I don't think that's my fault at all. All right. And this is it. I don't know how many laps would have gone by, but that was a big wreck. Let's see how... Uh... Go, go, go. Alright, we're under 10 laps to go. Slowing the gas. 
this is going to be very this could be a good moment for us to run away with it oh my goodness it this car is this truck is very quiet by the way almost at three tenths of a second Oh, another yellow is out. Wonder what happened this time. Did bro litter? Bro littered right behind me. Uh, excuse me. What was that? All right. Boy, if you don't go to the pit and repair that. Had to brake check them real quick. For that spin earlier. Got me three tenths of a second. Is Kurt Busch really going to try to outrun me here? Halfway out of gas. Two laps to go. Oh my goodness. I'm getting a little bit too loose. Oh, side by side. A little bit of contact right there. Overtakes. Oh my goodness. And that is another yellow. Great timing for that caution. What happened this time? Mike Bliss littering on the track. What in the world are you doing? I was just about to take the white flag too. Oh my goodness, a couple people got hit with that. Y'all don't put tape on your cars? Like, what are y'all doing? All right, looks like we got ourselves a green-white checkered situation here. Oh, what? Never mind. Th that's it. Wow. I was not expect. I thought we was gonna get a green-white checkered. It's like, nope, y'all, y'all ruined it. This is how it ends. Well, that was kind of anticlimactic. Let's see this thing. All right. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's go. Look at that, a perfect donut. Hit the moonwalk. finally won a race with the UPS truck. Uh, you know how long has it been since we actually won a race in the UPS truck? We've been trying for so long. And we finally got one done. And so now we have beef with Kurt Busch for that now. Oh, Michael Waltrip is actually the real uh, enemy right there. 
be especially with that big wreck I'm glad we didn't have to face him again let's look at the, re the highlight reel I take the lead I stay in the lead there goes that truck again So a lot of things to keep in mind. This is just regular race mode. This ain't the season, but uh, we might do a chase for the cup format right after this. So make sure y'all leave a comment. Let me know what y'all think. Cause uh, I really think that would be pretty funny. But this is gonna conclude us racing the truck for uh, Freddy J Sports. I'm Freddy J. Y'all have a good day and a better tomorrow. Until next time, we'll see ya.